are all today we are going to discuss drawing straight line graphs how do we draw an equation of a straight line on a coordinate grid as we know that in a coordinate grid we will be having x axis and y axis so here my question is to draw the line of equation which is y equals 2x minus 1 i have to draw this straight line of equation on a coordinate grid but before that we have to know the values of x and y okay so how do we find the values of x and y to find the straight line into the coordinate grid so first of all i can just take the value of x just take the value of x as 0 okay so if i am taking the value of x as 0 what will be the corresponding value of y? How do we find the value of y? So the given equation of the straight line is y equals 2x minus 1. This is the equation of the straight line and I just choose the value of x which is equal to 0. So to get the value of y, you are just substituting the value of x as 0. So what does mean mean by 2x? 2x which means that 2 multiplied by x. And what is the value we have taken here? x 0. We can choose any value for x. I am choosing here 0 as an example. Okay. So if I am taking the value of x as 0. What is 2 multiplied by 0? You are just multiplying with the value because this is 2x. 2x means 2 multiplied by 0 minus 1. What is 2 multiplied by 0, it will be 0 minus 1. What is 0 minus 1? You will get negative 1. Okay, so what is the here? Here it is y. So y equals negative 1 will be the value when you have chosen the value of x as 0. So when you are taking the value of x as 0, you are getting the corresponding value of y as negative 1. So this is the way you are choosing the values of x and y in the coordinate. Okay, so here x is getting 0 and the coordinate for y axis will be negative 1. So let's take the first coordinate point which is 0 and negative 1. So choose the first coordinate as 0 and negative 1. Okay, so I have got one point. And consider the other value for x. Consider x as 1. Choose, you can choose any value. So I am choosing let x be 1. So what will be the corresponding value of y? The same format you are taking the equation of the line y equals 2x minus 1. And Substitute the value which is chosen here. Here x I have chosen the value for x which is 1. Okay so just substitute the value of x. 2x means 2 multiplied by x. So what is 2 multiplied by 1? 2 multiplied by 1 will be 2 and minus 1. What is 2 minus 1? 2 minus 1 will be equal to 1. So when you have chosen the value of x is 1, you are getting the corresponding value of y which is also equal to 1. So we are getting the another coordinate which is x is 1 and y is 1. So we have got two coordinates. Okay, let's consider the third point of coordinate. So the first coordinate which is 0 and 1 and we have chosen the other value which is 1 and 1. Choose the another value for x. It's not compulsory that you have to choose 1, 2, 3 like that. You can choose in any way. So I am choosing the next value for x which is 3. Okay, so what will be the value of y? Choose the equation y equals 2x minus 1 and what is the value of x you have taken it's 3 so what is 2x 2x means 2 multiplied by x 
x here it is 3. So what is 2 multiplied by 3? What is 2 multiplied by 3 which is 6. And here you have the equation minus 1. So minus 1. What is 6 minus 1? 6 minus 1 will be 5. So the value which is corresponding to y is equal to 5. So when you have chosen the value of x as 3, you are getting the corresponding value for y which is 5. Okay, so I have got another coordinate point which is 3 and 5. So these are the coordinates we are choosing to find the straight line on the coordinate grid. For the corresponding equation y equals to x minus 1. Okay, we have three coordinates. Now I am going to plot the points in the grid. So, what's the first point of the coordinate? Here the coordinate is 0 and negative 1. As we know that the first coordinate which represents for x axis and the second one which represents for y axis. So choose the value of x as 0. So where is x axis? x axis is this and here this will be 0. Okay, so choose the value of x axis is 0 and y is negative 1. So where is y? y axis you are getting negative 1 and x is 0. So where will be the coordinate? Here is the coordinate you have taken. So this is 0 and negative 1. Okay. Choose the next coordinate. Which is the second coordinate we have chosen. Choose the next coordinate which was 1, 1. So choose the values for x and y. So here x axis the value which is 1 here. And for y axis is check here. 1 is here. And choose the coordinate of this. So which will be x is 1 and y is 1. And just plot the point. Choose the next point which is 3 and 5. So here this is the next coordinate. Choose a point on the grid. So where is 3 and 5? The first one which represent for x axis. So where is 3? Choose on x axis, you are getting 3 here, and the second value for y. So, where is y? Here, y axis, you are getting the value which is 5 here, and choose the coordinate for this. Okay, now we have got 3 coordinates and we have plotted the points. To get the line of the equation, you are just joining these three points. So just join the three points to get a straight line of the equation. So this is the line which is y equals 2x minus 1. So this is the line of the equation y equals to x minus 1 you have plotted on the coordinate grid. This is the format. Let's consider another example. y minus 2x plus 3 equals 0. In this example, the value or the relationship between x and y it is not given directly. Okay, so we have to rearrange the given equation of the line to get the values or to get the relationship between x and y directly. Which means you have to get the equation after rewriting y equals something. This is the form you have to get the relationship between x and y directly which means explicitly okay so how can i rewrite this given equation as a form of y equals something so how can i rewrite this one to get the value of y which means that you have to move other terms of this equation into the next 
place of the equal sign y minus 2x plus 3 equals 0. So how can I write this as y equals? Here if I just move these two terms minus 2x plus 3. If I move this one I can say that y equals is it? So how can I move this to the next term? Moving the other terms which is nearest to y to the next equal sign. So I need to move these two terms minus 2x and plus 3. So how can I move this to the next term? By changing the sign. So minus 2x. How can I change this? If I am moving to the next side, you are taking the opposite sign of it. So it becomes positive. So two minus 2x will become plus. Okay, the sign is getting the opposite which becomes plus. And here it's plus 3. So by changing it, it will become minus 3. Okay, so after rearranging the equation, you can see that y equals 2x minus 3. So this is the form. The relationship between x and y is showing directly, which means in explicit form. After getting this type of equation, you can just give the value of x. Give the value of x as 0, 1, 2, 3. You can choose any as I said just before. Okay, choose any value for x and substitute into the equation to get the value of y. Now I am going to show the value of x and y in a table form. So the value of x and y I am just going to choose. Okay. First I am going to give the value of x is 1. So if I put the value of x is 1. What is 2 multiplied by 1? 2 multiplied by 1 will be 2. And minus 3. So 2 minus 3 will become negative 1. Is it? Yes. So the value you are giving for x is 1. And you are getting the corresponding value for y. After substituting into the equation you are getting it is negative 1. Okay. Next. Choose any other value for x. Let's take the value of x as 2. Okay. So instead of x I am giving 2. So 2x means 2 multiplied by x which is 2 multiplied by 2. What is 2 multiplied by 2? 2 multiplied by 2 will be 4 and minus 3 from it. So 4 minus 3 will become 1. So when you have chosen the value of x is 2. So I can write x is 2. When I put the value of x is 2, what did you get the value of y? Corresponding value of y will be 1. Then... Let's give another value for x, which is 3. Okay, so 2 times x, which means 2 times 3. So you have given the value of x as 3. 2 times 3 will be 6. 6 minus 3. 6 minus 3 will become 3. So when you give the value of x as 3, you are getting the value for y also it is 3. Okay. So, you can just get the value of x and y directly and you can show it in the table. Next, what is the next step? We have to plot this points in the grid. So, what is the first coordinate? You are choosing the value of x is 1 and y is negative 1. So, 1 and negative 1. Choose the value. Where is x? x axis. You are getting the value of x is 1. And y will be negative 1. So choose the coordinate. So you have got the first coordinate. Then what is the second one? 2 and 1. So where is 2? X axis. The value of 2 is here. And in y axis the value of 1 is this. So choose the coordinate. Corresponding to it. Okay. Next. What is the next? 3 and 3. So, what is 3 and 3? Plot the coordinate into the grid. 3 and 3. So, you have got 3 coordinates on the grid. Then, what is the next step? 
you have to draw a straight line for the equation so just join these three coordinates to get the straight line of equation so this is the straight line of equation of equation what y minus 2x plus 3 equals 0 so this is the format you have to remember if the question is which is given implicit form you have to rewrite the form of equation as explicitly like y equals something after that find the values of x and y by substituting the value into the equation after getting the coordinates you will be just plotting on the grid and just joining the points this is the form you are drawing a straight line graph thank you for listening